I come to you with some breaking news that the Boston Uprising have signed main tank Itzal from their academy team. This is definitely a bit of a head-scratcher. They already have Marvel, who is one of the most flexible tanks in the game. Why would they opt to have three tanks for a one tank slot? Well, there are a few possibilities. Marvel does have a few gaps in its hero pool despite its flexibility. Mar Itzal, Hammond, and Winston are very good, and that could lend itself to the new high-mobility Doomfist tank. Potentially even the new Arista as well. We don't really have anything to go off of on how the new Orissa will be played, though, but it could fit his playstyle now. We could see Marvel playing the Shield tanks, Ryan and Sigma, Punk playing the Off tanks, and Itzal playing the Winston, Doom, Hammond, and potentially Orissa. But honestly, if this is the case, I'm not a huge fan of it. It'll be so difficult to build synergy between the tanks and the rest of the roster if there's a rotating door of three different tank players. I'd rather they just have Marvel grind the rest of the tank heroes. He's already your lead at the Ryan and Sigma. The other option is simply that Marvel isn't cutting it for Overwatch 2 or that he's retiring. The teams have been scrimming for a while, and they'd likely know if Marvel is underperforming. Don't be surprised if we get a farewell Marvel in the next few days, but I just feel bad for Marvel. All his career, he's been overshadowed by Gesture, and now he may be overshadowed by a rookie in Itzel. I'm really hoping he can get a shot in the spotlight. He was great in 2020 and 2019. Also, expect a rookie profile in Itzel. Thanks for watching, and remember to like and subscribe for more. I upload nearly daily Overwatch League content, and I'm trying to hit that 1,000 subs by Season 5, so any subscription helps greatly. Thanks.